Hi friends, myself Harsha, I am from Harsha Trainings and today I am going to tell you the 5 best tips that one can follow in order to crack any software job. If you are following these 5 tips which are going to be given by me today, definitely you will be cracking your dream job, you will be getting into your dream job on time. And what are the 5 tips? First one is continuous learning and the second one is the continuous practical preparation third one is continuous research and the fourth one is be ready to give any interview and the fifth one is learn from your mistakes if you follow these five tips definitely you will be cracking any interview of any software job in our we have drawn these five points from our experience and what we have seen uh, from the students in our surveys. So this is what we have observed. So many students, they learn the technologies and they wait on giving the interviews and they wait on preparing for the interview again. Like if your course is three months, you learn for three months and many people they wanted to give a gap or they wanted to take one or two months of time just for interview preparation after the course gets completed and by the time these people start preparing and giving the interviews there may not be any opportunities available in market so that's one of the problem see here the first point what i have told is continuous learning means it's not that one is going to start their preparation when there are opportunities posted but they should be ready and they should be continuously learning the subject whether there are today opportunities are there in the market or not no matter try to gain the subject knowledge so by continuous learning definitely you are going to gain good subject knowledge and the continuous practical preparation that is most important and your practice should not be limited only to what your trainer is teaching you daily and you need to think beyond and try to look at around uh, your, uh, your uh, around the environment you might be accessing so many applications in your day to day life software application try to implement the similar functionalities in your subject what you are learning so this is way you are going to have a continuous practice apart from doing the same example again and again and the third one is like continuous research try to research on the subject to go in depth into the subject and understand more about the subject by yourself by going through google or any other sources technical sources which are available in the uh, social media or anywhere in the market and having this continuous research you are going to know about so many best practices in the subject and so many in-depth points about the subject all this you are going to learn and uh, the fourth point is that be ready to give interview anytime which means that you have to always prepare theoretically practically and also you need to always think about interview point of view and try to research by yourself or get it from your trainer what is the interview point of view and what type of questions that they are going to ask and how they are creating the scenarios and you try to research to get more different scenarios out from your mind and try to answer yourself and try to solve those problems then your interview point of preparation also will be done and the fifth one and most important one is try to learn from your mistakes you might be making so many mistakes when you are giving interview so many people they start giving interviews today morning one interview today even afternoon another interview tomorrow morning another interview like this but this will never work out see at the time of initial stages of learning and presenting yourself it is very much essential that you have to take enough time to analyze yourself self analysis is most important so when you self analyze from the first interview what you have attended analyze yourself and then find out the mistakes that you have done find out the technical aspects which you are not able to answer find out the functional aspects which you are not aware of 
and now you take some time of one or two days time to research on all of these things and you learn and you prepare on the things and now once you you fill all the gaps and mistakes that you have done during first interview then you give the second interview so like this if you are going to repeat for one two three interviews definitely you will be cracking at least fourth interview for sure but once you crack an interview it is very easy to crack all other interviews so guys if you follow these five tips definitely you can crack any software job on any technology for sure and i'm going to repeat the five points once again it is continuous learning continuous preparation and continuous research and uh, ready be ready to give an interview any point of time and learn from your mistakes so i hope all of you like this video if you like this like the content share this video to your friends and post your questions related to any questions of your uh, if you're looking for career guidance in the comment box of this video we are happy to always reach out to you and guide you to reach your success in a better path so thank you so much